I'm Kay Zimmer with Forcepoint Engineering. This video highlights just a few of the many features available in a standard deployment of Forcepoint Web Security Cloud, which I'll refer to as the Cloud Service. While the focus of this video is on Web Security Cloud, the user interface shown includes Email Security Cloud as well as Data Security features. Once you're up and running with the Cloud Service, you can view the dashboard for up-to-date graphical data on malware, browsing statistics, data security incidents, bandwidth, and email activity, and use real-time malware analysis to protect your network from web-based threats. You can define the actions you want to take for sites in categories created by Forcepoint, and also create your own web categories. You can also customize notification pages to display to users when web access is denied. Additionally, the extensive reporting options enable you to examine trends and statistics for web browsing, customize existing reports, and create new reports using a drag-and-drop interface, and schedule reports for delivery. The dashboard provides a snapshot view of how the cloud service is performing. By default, when you log on to the Forcepoint Security Portal, you are shown the Threats Dashboard, which gives information about top security risk locations, top security risk sites, and top threat types, among others. The Threats Dashboard is one of a set of predefined dashboards. You can also create your own custom dashboards for up to 10 dashboards in total. The Web Content and Security tab in a policy gives you options to help protect your organization from inbound or outbound malware. Analysis by the Forcepoint Advanced Classification Engine, or ACE, enables the cloud service to detect blended threat attacks in real time and perform real-time content and security classification. File type analysis lets you choose specific file formats like executables or PDFs for analysis. The cloud service uses the Forcepoint Master Database, the industry's most accurate, current, and comprehensive classification of URLs. Each category has an action associated with it that determines whether and how users can access the site. For example, the gambling category on this page has the action Block Access, which means users are prevented from going to sites in this category. In addition to using the Forcepoint defined categories, you can set up your own custom categories. This lets you define your own groups of URLs that should be blocked or allowed for members of your organization. When a policy denies access to a resource or needs to inform the user of an event, the cloud service can display an appropriate notification page. There is a standard set of notification pages included with the cloud service, and you can either modify these to suit your needs or add your own pages. You can then refer to the notification pages from any of your policies. To view and create notification pages, go to Web, Policy Management, Block and Notification Pages. Each notification is a complete HTML page, and you can use any valid HTML within the pages. You can also set a default logo and footer text specific to your organization, and configure the cloud service to serve language-specific pages based on end users' browser settings. The cloud service provides exceptional reporting functionality with a complete view of web traffic and usage. In the dashboard charts described earlier, you can click on a bar in the chart to drill down further, view the report results in a variety of formats, and download the statistics as a CSV or PDF file. In addition, you can access the report catalog by going to Reporting, Report Center, Report Catalog. The report catalog offers a list of predefined reports. Copy any predefined report to apply your own filters to create a custom report. You can also use the Report Builder to create completely custom reports, then save your reports for future use. See the video about the Report Builder for more on this useful tool. 
Transaction View enables you to see full details for individual web transactions and requests. Where Report Builder shows you high-level analysis from the perspective you wish to apply, Transaction View gives you an additional layer of granular information for each transaction. You can manipulate the data further by adding extra filters and columns. See the video about drilling into report details. We hope this video has helped inform you about some of the most important aspects of Forcepoint Web Security Cloud. For additional materials, go to support.forcepoint.com. Thank you for watching.